So I was a full-time hairdresser at the time. And I remember just telling my clients, I'm like, why, what, what do you guys do for bunk beds? And everyone's like, oh, I just throw a blanket up there or I don't make their bed or, you know, and I'm like, that's just not a solution for me. So anyways, when I made their prototype, I guess, I remember telling my clients, I'm like, oh, I ended up doing this. And they're like, Betsy, that is such a good idea. Like I would buy that. You should patent it and you should start a business. So I was like thinking, oh, it'll be like side hustle, kind of a hobby business. I had no idea that there would be so many people in this world that had issues with making the bed. Bunk beds, like, in, and in my mind, it was just bunk beds. I, I didn't even think of RV beds. I didn't think of people with like special needs or arthritis where it's hard to make a bed. I was just trying to like figure out how to solve the bunk bed issue. And so that's how Betty's started. Anyways, I ended up going and getting my friend.